Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I thought I'd do this live this morning. I was going to do a video but I'm, I fell asleep after Foundation Friday in the middle of a wear test. So I'm going to be uploading that in a minute. So as that's going out late, um, I don't want to spend the whole day editing so I thought I'd do this live. But a couple of you, excuse my, my um, dressing gown, which is in dire need of a wash because I've got makeup all over the collar. So excuse that. It's going in the washing machine today. <laughs> um, so a, cu a couple of weeks ago, I did a live and um, a couple of you were talking about um, having a bargain of the week slot. And then I found a bargain, and this is the bargain of a and a half. Now, if you're in the US, of a and a half. Now, if you're in the US, mm, if you're in the US, I'm not sure. Hello, Linda. This really is a bargain, right? It, I just and I've checked it out as well, because when they make claims about this stuff is worth this, I always go and I check it. So yesterday, I spent about 15 minutes going through all the items in this thing that's coming up. <laughs> yeah, I bet it's not matching the collar with all the makeup on it at the moment. It needs dire need of a wash. I got this actually as a bargain, Maria. Um, a couple of years ago, it was in John Lewis at Christmas in the sale for £10. <laughs> I hope you didn't pay too much more for yours. <laughs> um Great, I'm glad we got matching dressing gowns. So here is a bargain of the week. In fact, I would say the bargain of the year. So I spent about about a quarter of an hour, 20 minutes yesterday, going through each item, working out what it would cost the full site per mil and all of that to make sure that their claim was correct. And it's it's almost correct. So the claim is that this box is worth £280. But don't run away because it's not going to cost you anywhere near that. So I went through everything to check and I made it 274 which is still pretty good. So if you live in the UK and you want a real bargain in terms of makeup and skincare, then stay watching because this is a bargain and a half. So basically it's a Marks and Spencer's beauty advent calendar and I saw Martin Lewis talking about it on breakfast telly and actually that's a lie my other half saw Martin Lewis talking about it and said Ali come on watch this you'll be interested and he's probably going to regret that because this probably would take up half the flat but let me just show you this beauty advent calendar um it's not online go online get it online and get it delivered to you Linda it's still available I checked before I did this video so this is the beauty advent calendar and it cost me 35 pounds, right? 35 pounds, right? Um, now you got to spend 35 pounds on clothing or um, yeah, go and get it. It's online, it's still available online and get it delivered. Um, so you got to spend 35 pounds on clothing or beauty or there's a few things that you can get but i just bought a jumper because i needed a winter jumper so as long as you spend 35 pounds you can buy this for 35 pounds and look at it i can't even get it in the screen let me just open it up for you and show you what it looks like inside okay now i'm going to read to you what is in this calendar okay because it is insane and i as i said i sat down worked out all the prices full size to make sure that they weren't exaggerating about the 280 pound i got to 274 um so i might be missing something but for even 274 for 35 pounds is pretty good let me read you what's in it and then if you like, I can show you. Just let me know. So it's got um, a Nooks Luxurious Body Cream, a Diego Dalla Palma Eye Pencil, 
Um, they're all smaller, not all of them are smaller sizes. There's a couple of full sizes, but price per mil, it still works out a lot more than £35. Ico Lash Alert Mascara, a Percy and Reed Perfectly Perfecting Wonder Overnight Recovery, the Hero Project Higher Soft Instant Moisture Boost, this works deep sleep pillow spray. This works in transit camera close up mask moisturizer and primer in one. Skin Iceland berry lip fix with wintered red algae. Uh, a Philip Kingsley pomegranate and cassis elasticizer for the hair. You have a Leighton Denny high performance nail color. Living proof hair five in one styling treatment. Studio 10 Lip Perfecting Balm Gloss, a Pure Afterglow Skin Perfecting Powder Highlighter. Ah, I think I might have missed that one in the in the adding up. I don't remember adding that one up. A Filorga Time Filler for Eyes, a Steelux. I'm off to work this afternoon. My wages for today are exactly £36, so I think that my wage plus... You do have to spend, though, another £35. You need to have 70 because you've got to spend £35 on clothing or whatever to be able to buy it for £35. So you would need to have £70. I hope that doesn't mean it's out of reach for you, Maria. But it, it, it is definitely worth it. Um, or, or get a Christmas present. If you've got some put aside, get a Christmas present for someone with the other £35. And then, and then get this um, if you have it. But you do have to spend thirty-five to buy it for thirty-five. Okay, that's the catch. But it's still. Oh, great! There you go. Oh, brilliant! But if you can't get it in store, go online. It's still available online. Okay, and get it delivered to you. I, I would definitely get it delivered to you because it's huge. Okay, I'll carry on. So you get um, Filorga Time Filler for Eyes, a Steeler Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner, a L'Occitane Immortal Divine Cream and Advanced Anti-Aging Skincare. You get a L'Occitane Verbena Shower Gel, an Autograph Blusher Brush, a, um, Absolute Sleep Cream from Marks & Spencers, a Pry Throat and Decolletage Cream, uh, Balance Me Wonder Eye Cream, which I have the tinted one, it's very good. Pixie Rose Tonic, an Autograph Luminosity Luxe Multi Bronzer, a Ren V Sense Revitalizing Night Cream, and a Shea and Blue Black Tulip Natural Spray Fragrance. And I can confirm because I added this up to be £274, but I definitely don't remember. Um, working out the pure afterglow skin perfecting powder so it is over 280 pounds worth because that would definitely be worth more than six pound okay so this is it um <clears throat> i got myself um a couple of because you know marks do some really good cheap jumpers i got myself a roll neck jumper for about 17 pounds i got and 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 a pair of earrings and that was it um now do you want to see what do you want to see some of them i'm not sure i can empty all of them but let me let me i'll see if i can so they're all little boxes like that and you just pull them out i've pulled out a couple i haven't pulled them all out i think my other half's going to regret this in terms of space telling me about this calendar but he knew I'd love it. So let me take out... You, I tell you what, how about instead of me picking them all out, any of you that are watching, have a look and pick a number. How about that? Pick a number and I will... <laughs> pick a number and I will pull the number out and show you what's in it. 25 is quite lucky. Four. Number four. Okay, let's... Jack, you could be my assistant. Help me find number four. Oh, okay. Uh, there. No. That's 20. Number four. Okay. Didn't... Have I seen... No, no, no. Number four looks like uh, number 25. Number four. Here we go. Number four. So they're all boxes and they slide out. 
shame it's not a drawer unit really because then you could use it for your makeup afterwards but don't worry i'm going to find a use for it here is number four like my pokemon number cards. four is ico lash alert mascara there you go quite a generous size four mils so that would be that would last you quite a long time hey mum yes you know what's kind of lucky jack is your glamorous assistant yeah do you want to pick another number? I've got, I've put it down on the floor, so I'm not going to keep I bending would have down. I four because there are four people watching this. Um, if you pick another. No, look. The... Oh no, it's five. Now. Five. Can you put that, slot that back? You know where that went? Yeah, right here. Yeah, uh, that's it. Right. Hi, Ali. Hi, Deborah. I'm showing everybody the. Oops. Anyone going to pick a number? Do you know what, Jack? I, my 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 assistant. While they're picking a number, will you go and get the phone charger? I've gotta say, six looks like a lucky one. So anyone. Wants Jack, can you get the phone charger so I can plug it in so I don't run out of juice while I'm doing this live? Does anyone want to pick a number from one to twenty-five? I desperately want to pick six. You want to? All right. Well, you can pick a number two. You pick six. Oh, okay. Go on, what, what's it? Oh, because it, it looks pretty. Yeah, Excuse yeah, me a yeah, second. This, this is six. Right, and Deborah, we're just going through the advent calendar of Marks and Spencers, showing people <coughs> what's inside it. I've just read out what's in it, people. Um, hey, that's, that's kind of good. Kind of good. Oh, God. Philip Kingsley Elasticizer for the hair. There you are. Sorry about the light in here. <sighs> Foundation Friday, by the way, is on its way to you. I fell asleep on the sofa before I could do my final check-in. And I've just finished editing, so it will be uploaded shortly. Okay, any other numbers? Do you want to pick another number? Anyone? Hang on, let's put that I back. Would, I would kind of suggest 22 because it looks like, like most like the colours you use. All right, then, let's pick 20. Oh, hang on, number 16. Right, okay, number 16. Okay, I'll find number 16. Mm -hmm. He loves helping. Oh, do you know what? I'm got, I've got this out here. I'm going to put some on. Some there Mac is Fix 16, Plus. a pink one. Oh, number 16. Okay, here we go. Glamour Eyes, it says. Ooh, glamour eyes. Let's and number oh, Deborah wants number two. Okay, I'll pick number two. Right. Well. And this is the Diego Della Palma eye pencil. There we go. So number two. Put that one back and pick number two for Deborah. It's so hard to find the numbers, you know. Oh, but don't forget uh, don't you put it back so that hang on, you put it back so we can't see the number. No, you oh. to put it back so you can see Oh yeah. Number. number two. Uh, do you know what? Oh, there's number two. Treat your and it says treat yourself. It says it. treat yourself. Treat yourself. Okay, treat yourself. Very well done, Jack. So this is Deborah's lucky number. Deborah number two is oh Filorga time filler eyes. I've never tried this. But what I am looking want? forward to trying this. Creme Absolute Correction. So there is four mils in this. And I did. I went through everything and checked the price. So the full size of this is £55. Pounds. And it, I can't remember how many mils. But this four mils is... is you're going to get quite a bit from an eye cream out of four mils. Right, number two. What... Uh, I need some of that. Thank you, Jack. So, <coughs> Deborah, I, I think I sent you this link yesterday. You have to spend 35 to get it for 35 And it's still, if it's not available in your store, it is available on the website. Right, you want to show another one, yes, do you? Yes, Which one yes. have you picked? 21. Number 21. That's, do you know what? That's 21. really clever, Jack. Do you know why? Why? Because that's my age. No, it isn't. <laughs> Age is like 40-something. And this is In Transit Camera Close-Up Mask, Moisturiser and Primer in one. Mm. And uh, it's got lots of... This one is... I think this was full size. Um, I think this... Oh, number, number 14. 14. Okay, right. I'll grab number 14. Right at the top. Put that one back. Okay. 
because I, I I hope this isn't like a puzzle that when you take too many out, you can't fit them back back in. It's a bit like the Rubik's Cube, but I, no, it probably no, isn't. No, it's not going to be like the Rubik's Cube. Right, number 14. Okay, just because you were talking about your age, I just want to pick number 10. Oh, it's a... Uh, I want to pick number 10. A Leighton Denny glass nail file. I'm picking number 10 because that is my age. Okay, you pick number 10. Oh, Jack's opening this one. Mm. Oh, a full size. One perfectly perfecting wonder overnight recovery for <coughs> the hair. Oh, I could use that. <coughs> Apply okay. to dry hair at bedtime. The nail files are brilliant. Do you know what I did? I had one years ago. Not from, not from that company. It was. Uh, Oh, do you know? Well, I can't remember names, but it was another company that sold on QVC. Quite a well-known um, company that sells um, nail varnish, Excuse sort of high-end. Um, but yes, they are good. I'd forgotten how Any good actually. Any other numbers? Any other numbers? Jack's loving doing this, so call out your numbers. <laughs> yeah, and it's different from... Jack, do you want to help? And it's different yeah. from my old calendar. Jack, since pick we've... up the box again. Let's see if people want to look at it before they pick their number. I... Oh, from QVC. That's probably the same make then as the one I've got. So here we go. In case there's a particular box that... Um, catches your eye or you i'll do just, one more <clears throat> or you could just pick the number that's closest to your age and i tell you what jack you can do something else for me please yeah before i go there's another box in the kitchen a silver box can you bring it in because i want to show people this any other numbers or shall i move on you mean the one wrapped in the bubble wrap yes that's it yes Sorry. I'll move on. I'll move on. We'll shut this one. Now. Oh, 25. Oh, 25. 20. I saw 25. We already I, sneaked what's in 25, yeah, Deborah. Yeah, I told, I told her it was bad luck. <laughs> it, it's definitely It's not bad luck if I'm showing my viewers. Oh, yeah. It's, it's definitely not. <sighs> Jack wants this. Yeah, I want it. It works. I, Deep I sleep need it. spray. I need it. You need it. I need it. I need it. I need <laughs> like go over to sleep at midnight. Here, Jack, give me the box back, please. Um, Jack does does find it difficult to get off to sleep. He's like me. Um, but he likes um. What I often do is I give him a little hand massage with um. The um Neil's Yard lavender cream, and he loves it. He says, Mum, go and get the lavender cream. Can you put that back for me, please? Okay. So I don't have to bend down. Now, I am... Are you a night owl? We're all night owls. That's why we watch beauty videos, you see, on YouTube. Wait, isn't that the place I used to go, night owls? Yep, yeah, you did. That's what we call somebody that wants to... Night now, owl. I'm going to show okay, you okay. this. Now, I've been looking this morning and I cannot find this available. But I'm going to keep looking for you. This came out on QVC, if I can open the box without tearing it, because I hate tearing boxes. This came out on QVC um, about a month ago, and I talked about it on one of my lives. And I said, if you get it, get it. It's a bargain. And it is a bargain, and it looks stunning. It's the IT Cosmetics Beauty Book. Right, now... I haven't seen it available since then on QVC and I don't know if they're bringing it back but I'll show it you because once I show it you we're all going to be searching I know this is it look at this right isn't that stunning right and I'm going to show you what's inside it so this I got in three installments and it was 48 pounds Okay, now you open it up. Use my hand oh, it might help off. if I held it up the right way. You open it up, and on the first page, you have three bye-bye under-eye concealers. I know, isn't it? 
three bye bye under eye concealers. Then you have bye bye pores, the um, the setting powder. <coughs> then you have underneath there bye bye pores bronzer. Okay. Then you open it up again, and in the middle. I'm just getting rid of all those plastic things. In the middle, you've got three lipsticks at the top. There, you've got um, the blush, which is a full-size blush. And that's in Je Ne Sais Quoi, which is one of their most famous shades. Let me just swatch some of that. It's very like... I've never bought NARS Orgasm, but it's apparently very like it. Um, and then underneath, you've got... Hello Light, which is their um, highlighter. But we've not finished yet. Okay, so that's in the middle. And then you open it up at the end. There's a mirror at the end. And then here you have... Oh, there's another plastic sheet. Um, so you have at the top, you have um, eye primer. Then those are the eyeshadows in the middle, which actually don't... The camera doesn't do justice. They they remind me a lot of looking at the Bobbi Brown eyeshadows. They they look like they'd be very flattering on older lids like mine. And then you have at the bottom, you have Supreme Eyeliner in black, and that next to it is a brow, a universal brow taupe brow thing. Um, so. In that, basically, you've got your concealer, your powder, your bronzer, your blush, your highlighter, three lipsticks, nine eyeshadows, an eyeshadow primer, a brow, a brow product, and an eyeliner. So all you need would be mascara and a foundation, and everything is. Then it all closes together in this book and that's it look that's my hand it's no bigger than my hand so brilliant for kind of slipping in a, a, a weekend away and you've got six you've got nine eyeshadows so you could get plenty of looks i know <laughs> do you know what i tuned in that evening and i i hadn't been watching i honestly it sounds like i hadn't been watching qvc for a long time and I thought I wonder what bargains they've got on QVC and they said this has just come in you you got it's not going to be out till November but you can pre-order it um but please you know do it because they're going fast and then it was in three installments as well so like I've only had to pay 15 pounds this month and they don't start charging you until they deliver it so this is so far I know it sounds like I'm doing a thing it is it's very... i mean obviously i don't need any more makeup but i do the it i've got a couple of it cosmetics i had still haven't bought their bb cream although a lot of you have recommended it but i do have their sunshine bronzer the big one with the brush um which i love because it's a matte bronzer and it looks really flattering and I do have their Bye Bye Under Eye, but it's a bit too light for me. But now I can mix it with what's in here because there's a light, a medium tan and a tan rich. So I can get my exact shade. <laughs> oh, good. You're chatting to one another. That's great. So, yeah. And isn't that stunning? And it came in a gift box and it was all wrapped up with a ribbon. And it said something about your you make the world more beautiful so it's a brilliant christmas present except when i see something like that the present goes to me i'm sorry i'm so bad and then there's a little leaflet in here now if i manage to find it i can't find it anywhere i i think have a look on the it cosmetics site if you're in the us you might be able to get it um but i can't find it anywhere i can't find it on qvc um, if I find it, I will, I'll do a live update and let you know. 
Yeah, you were telling me, and I, it's the one that I've tried, and I keep thinking, oh, should I, should I not? And I've got so many foundations that I think, you know, I've got to start using some of them up. Finish it. Finish it. At least finish one before I buy a new one. Um, and that'll probably be my Mac one, to be honest. That's the one I use the most. Um, I need to finish one of them before I buy a new one, I think. I'm being strict with myself. Oh, oh, can you? Oh, I might do that then. Oh, we're so bad for one. I have to buy two of those type presents. Hang on a minute. It Chat options. Live chat. Right, okay. I have to buy two of these types of presents as I always get tempted to get... Yeah, I'm sorry. I did actually, when I saw this that night, I did ring up my sister and said, I don't need any more makeup. I said, would you like makeup for Christmas? She said, I don't need any more makeup. Um, so, yeah, but if... I'm the same. I, I, I One for them, one for me. It, Christmas is terrible because if it's anything beauty related, it's always one for them and one for me, which is bad, really. But it's my hobby, so who cares? And I put, I put about as much. Oh, oh, good. You had some food arrive. Well, I hope you managed to get your advent calendar online because they are still available online. And you don't have to carry it back from the shops then, Linda. Because I tell you what, that would... I don't know... I know you said you were disabled. I'm not sure if you're a wheelchair user, but I tell you, that would take up most of the wheelchair space. So you can get it delivered. I'm not sure I could have fit that on my scooter, to be honest. I'd have had a bit of trouble. I've got a big scooter bag, but it wasn't... Oh, brilliant. Um, I've got a big scooter bag, but I tell you what, it would have had its work cut out to get that in there. <clears throat> so I've just got to find room for that now. Um, but the other half can't blame me because he, he called me in to see it on Breakfast TV. So um, if he says anything about, oh, we've got no more room in this flat. <clears throat> Why did you get that? I'll say, I, was, uh, I wouldn't have heard about it had you not called me in. And told me to watch it on breakfast TV. <laughs> no, I think he might quite like to get it for Christmas presents as well. But I better keep my mouth shut in case anybody from his family are watching. But it is it would be a good Christmas present. Your medium tat Linda, are you are you the same skin tone as me? Because be useful to know. Oh right. You've got cerebral palsy, Maria. I read that book by Francesca Martinez and you know she um she I contacted her and she replied and said I love your book um she's lovely and I did I have got um a Facebook group called Disabled Mums and um she she joined um just cuz I asked her to but I haven't I've been neglecting it a lot recently because I've been getting into beauty and stuff. It was it was when Jack was a lot younger and there were lots of Wait, difficulties what? in what are you talking about? when when you were a lot younger. I do I I started up a group called Disabled Mums because you used to run off as you know. Oh yeah. He, he used to do all sorts of things that like scared the, the living I, daylights like out of the me. Time I lied on the road. Oh yeah, it <laughs> I must find that group. Oh, I'll um, <clears throat> yeah, do do. I mean, there's a lot of people there that are still chatting. It's just I'm neglecting it a little bit. So if I see What's your request you coming in, it's called Disabled Mums Forum on Facebook. You make the group. Medium fair, far too light. Yes, I made the group. So Jack, as he just told you, he he lay down in the road because I because um, my he was okay. having a tantrum because you didn't buy me a magazine. Yeah, and he was having a tantrum, <laughs> and basically oh. he he ran off from me, pulled away from me, and he must have been about three, and he three lay four. down it in the road in central London. I'm pretty sure it was four, and I couldn't pick him up, and every time I was trying, my adrenaline was trying to pick him up. 
never mind my back, you know, I wanted to get him out the road. And every time I tried to pick him up, he just, he, he sort of dropped into a dead weight. So it was a one-way road. So I stood in front of him. Um, I stood in front, in front of him, so if a car came around the corner, it would hit me first. Um, let me just... But luckily, he got up. When he realised I wasn't going to do anything, I was powerless to do anything, and he still wasn't going to get his magazine, he got up in the end. Oh, why does it do this? They, it, they disappear. I put my toddler attached to his... Zach did that to me in Ikea, Newcastle. Eventually, I worked out a game, which was basically, you know, the freeze game. Oh, yeah. So we had Why to... Why don't we do that game anymore? Last time I did that game was a year ago. Well, right we now. can do it. So basically, I've, I live quite near Barbican Centre in London. And Barbican Centre is, is all up above street level and there's no roads. So I took him up there and I taught him this game, which was basically, you know... I said, I'm going to teach you a new exciting game. Shall we play it? I made it really fun and said, right, when I say freeze, you have to stop. And when I say go, you have to go. And I did this a few times with him up on the Barbican Centre until I knew that he was going to comply completely. And then I brought him down onto the road. And another mum saw me playing it one day and she said, oh, she said, that's amazing. She said, I know why you're doing that. Obviously, you can't run. But she said, I'm going to do that with my son because he's always running off and I can't always catch him, you know, and she was able-bodied because it, he, he then thought of it as a game, not me. Because children, if you say stop, they take it as a bit of a challenge to no, keep running. A year ago, I realised uh, you just wanted me to, like, just stop running off. Yeah, I mean, once and you then, get to a um, certain age, but, you realise. Yeah, I realised it, but I still wanted to play it. Oh, well, you see, that's good then. So, um, anyway, so medium tan is the best shade, do you think, for me, Linda? Sorry, we've gone off the subject a little bit. It comes a lot lighter than you think. Medium's far too light. Okay, so I need to look at medium tan then, do you think, for my skin colour? Are you about the same as me? You probably already answered me. Let's have a look. Yeah, so I'm just wondering if, if Linda's about the same skin tone as me. Um, but I might go into Boots and check it out. So um, I quite like this bargain of the week, but I don't know whether I my bank balance would be good to buy a bargain every week. But... If I see a bargain, I'll pop up and do a live. Because if you are not able to join me for the live, you can at least see it later on. Um, so when I see a bargain, I'll pop up and do a live. Oh, you, we, you're the same shade as me, Linda. Is that what you're saying when you say definitely? All right. <laughs> Sorry, I just like my voice changer. This, I'm hoping this is going to fade. That's from me trying to remove it. So it sort of, it did remove the tag, but it's now left that horrible mark. Okay, I'm actually creeped anyway, out right now. I can always colour correct it like I do I'm with this. Out. All right, well, I'm going to go unless anybody's got any questions. Has anyone got any questions before I go? I'm going to put on this little beauty today. Daniel Sandler sent me this as a thank you for last week for showcasing. It goes on darker, then after five minutes, the colour changes with your skin. Right, brilliant. So I go for medium tan. I'm going to go into Boots next week and get a sample. So Daniel Sandler sent me this after last week. And it's called Radiant Glow. Now, I thought this was exclusive to Beauty in the Boutique. Because I got a thank you card, and I'm sure they said that um, on the on the card. But anyway, it's not. It's available on Daniel Sandler as well. It's really beautiful. It's a skin. It's um, called Radiant Glow. It looks lovely on the skin. Very similar. Very similar. And I'm about to put this in my video that you're, is going to be uploaded. 
It's very similar to Pillow Talk. So if you missed out on Pillow Talk, the only thing is that this, the, the darker shade in Pillow Talk is a little bit darker, right? But if you're fair, that's not going to worry you. Um, Jack, what are you doing? He's I'm pulling out. The chair next to you. All right. Um, so anyway, he sent me this and I put it on my skin yesterday. So if you're on Instagram, you'll have seen it. But for some silly reason, I put Exaggerize on my eyes and I thought, why didn't I put this on? Anyway, so I put on my post, I'm really, really miffed now I didn't put this on my eyes as well. And he sent me a private message saying, try the pink on your eyes. And I did a bit of a play this morning before I took my makeup off. He said it would make your eyes pop. And, of course, he's such a great makeup artist. If he told me to put black on my eyes, I'd do it. Really? Yeah. That, but he, then do it. No, but he didn't tell me to put black on my eyes. Well, I'm telling he you He told to me it. to put the pink on my eyes, on my lids. He said it will really make your eyes pop. And, boy, is he right. So I'm going to make myself up with this. Um, and... Do you want me to film it and do a little get ready? Because uh, actually you can use this whole palette on your eyes, your cheeks and your lips. <clears throat> okay, I'll do a review of it. I'll, I'll make my... I'll do a get ready with me today. I'll film it. Um, Jack's arm is fine. Um, I did a little update on last week on one of my red lip videos. He, They thought he'd broken it in A&E and put him in plaster. Uh, have you seen the Beauty Bay brand palettes? No, I haven't. But well, I've just downloaded their app. Um, <clears throat> so I'll have a look at that. Um, I'm still tempted about getting the Huda Nude palette, but it looks quite similar to Stars In Your Eyes and other colours that I've got. And it's £56. And I, it's fine if I haven't got the colours, but if I've got the colours... <laughs> I will definitely have a look at those. <clears throat> um, so what was I saying? So Jack's arm, yeah. Um, they thought it was broken in A&E. They put him in plaster. But all the x-rays get sent to the paediatric fracture clinic for review from accident and emergency. And when the consultant saw it, he said it's not broken, but he has injured his soft tissue quite badly. Don't know how he could see that on an x-ray. But anyway, he did. He said that. So... Um, Jack, he said that he needed to stay in plaster for a week instead of six weeks. Yeah, and then to stay fine. in the sling for two weeks. But, of course, Jack being Jack, as soon as he heard his arm wasn't broken, immediately thought, yeah, I don't need to wear the sling. And I had to do quite a few mercy dashes to the school. <laughs> Look, hi, Jack. Hi. Because he was in pain. So eventually he worked out it was best to stay in the sling. So he stayed in that for two weeks and now his arm is absolutely fine. And see, Jack answers so much more succinctly to me. It was, hi, yeah, look, it's here, I'm fine. And I, what, what I say in six sentences, he says in one. I should learn from that, shouldn't I? <laughs> okay, so I'm, I'm going to get going. I might film this, get ready with me, using this Daniel Sandler. But I do want to, I might not do that today. Because um, <laughs> kids are so much better putting things in one sentence that we take six to do. <laughs> um, I might do it another day because I want to get Foundation Friday uploaded, which is Power Fabric by Giorgio Armani. Um, you won't see the last checking. Well, you will. You'll see a picture of me at five in the morning, having woken up five with all morning. my makeup on. <laughs> But there you go. I always like to keep it real. And we've all done it. My skin feels terrible for it. Oh, Deborah, I know because I've got a stepson who was about 14 when Jack was born. And, I thought uh, you said he was 12. No, I, I think he must have been. I thought he was 12, but he must have been 14. Well, that, well I'm kind of glad. Because yeah. I have a nephew now. And of... he's the one that has now just had a baby. And if you're following me on Instagram, you'll see a picture of my step-grandson who's called Maverick. He's lovely. He's really beautiful. Um, and, yeah, he's just had a baby. And I said to Louis, 
I said, who'd have thought when you were holding Jack in your arms Last time I saw him was at 14 me. that in 10 years' time you'd have your own? And it's, I know it's I nuts. I saw him uh, last week at a, uh, we saw him last week at a Halloween party. Yeah, grunts and eats. I'm looking forward to that stage, not because I'm still at the stage where I loved it. I love. I, I didn't the toddler stage. Jack, no, I, I, I love him more every day, and I loved him as a toddler. But it was hard work when he was a toddler and when he used to run off. But when he went out of that stage, I've loved that bit particularly ever since what me going out of my toddler stage? when when you stopped having tantrums and then you you and just then I started helping you you started helping me but not it's not just about helping me you started getting all cuddly and 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 lovely and helping you and then you'll you'll get into your teens and they're saying that their their uh, kids grunt they don't uh, speak anymore yeah. they go Ugh. So they're just like, oh, whatever. Exactly, that's it. Oh, whatever. I and that. mum, don't do your videos anymore because it's embarrassing. <laughs> and will I listen? No. I'm always going to have a girlfriend that's going to take over your channel. When you're no, involved. she's not taking over my channel. She can have her own channel. No, she's going to take over your channel because then you won't lose subscribers. Why would I lose subscribers? Because you might get old, very old, and you might want to, like, quit your channel. Never. I'm no quitter. Okay. I think we better go now. But um, I'm going to be uploading. <laughs> Can ask for lifts and money. Yeah. Um, I'm going to go and upload this Foundation Friday. Just not got to do a couple more edits. And it will be uploaded, yeah, but yeah, I found the new balloon. So you you can have a check in that's about twelve hours. No, not it's more than twelve hours. When did I put it on? It would have been about sixteen hours after I put it on. Um, so have a great day, and I hope you've enjoyed today. Go get your Marks and Spencers advent calendar while it lasts, because I, I I can't believe they've still got them. To be honest. And um, enjoy your day. And well, it's no I will definitely film this in the next couple of days and I will upload it doing my whole face with the Daniel Sandler Radiant Glow, which is on his site and it's also on Beauty in the Boutique. All right, take care. Don't Have a great like, day. Don't Bye. To like and subscribe. And They're already the liking video. and subscribing okay, then to watch me. The next video. Yeah. Okay, Jack's doing the promo. Go on then. Quick. I just said the promo. <laughs> Bye. The promo.